And moving on, Cabinet Secretary in the Ministry of Transport, Infrastructure and Development, James Mesharia, has signed a memorandum of understanding on the airport service charter between his ministry and the Ministry of Interior and Coordination of National Government, National Treasury, Ministry of Tourism, Ministry of Health, and the Ministry of Agriculture, Livestock, and Fisheries. The charter will also include customer service improvement action plan has been adopted by all agencies operating within JKIA to facilitate seamless interagency coordination and to signify the desire by stakeholders to take quality of service at the airport to new and world-class levels. I want to emphasize with the one statement James Masharia has said. It's very clear. It's not normal to see five ministers coming twice within a month. It is a serious issue, my, my, my colleagues. This is not just business as usual. And if you think business as usual, try us. It will not be business as usual. Every client and every visitor who comes in this country creates 11, every 11 visitors who come into this country create a job to a Kenyan. So if we mishandle that visitor, then we are destroying employment for our people. As simple as that, we have respective services here at the airport. When you come here as a stakeholder delivering a government service, it doesn't mean you become an obstacle. You must be facilitative to make a client feel he's welcome into the country. So there is, the infrastructure itself must be appropriate. So we also expect Kenya Airport Authority to up their game in terms of infrastructure. And as James said here, a lot of investment is already being put at Kenya Airport Authority or Jomo Kenyatta Airport. So we want to see results. The second thing is that it's very clear now the hierarchy and the chain of command. Johnny Anderson, you have taken responsibility. We will hold you responsible because you are the boss here. These colleagues of ours must realign to the chain of command. Because it's not about a process, it's about deliverables. If we don't deliver, then we have failed. And as James told us here, this cannot be failed, cannot be allowed to fail. Because it's so much strategic interest to the government, the sector plus our visitors both tourists, both business people, anybody who comes into the country creates life for our people. There are four fundamental areas we need to focus. I know you are going to look at many. The key one is migration services. The second one is customs. The third one is management of baggage. And the fourth one, and many more maybe are there, is security and safety of the passenger. Those are key, and they must be looked at seriously. And then the final one is the infrastructure itself. Is it appealing to the image of the destination? Because the first point of entry is Jomo Kenyatta International Airport, is the airport. If we don't do it right, then what happens behind the airport might be very messy. My final uh, uh, point, we have developed under Utali College a customer relations and a customer care curriculum. It's finalized. We are going to hand it over to you and our colleagues in Utali College. Your committee should verify and endorse that curriculum, and then you create a roster. Every public servant at this airport must go through that train. By 1st of January,